Hi guys, this is Ranjit and in this uh, video, let's have a closer look at the Samsung QLED 4K 2020 edition. And this is the highest range, that is the Q95T. It also comes in Q60, Q70, Q80, but this is the highest end. And guys, this comes in three variants, 55 inch, 65 and 75. This is the 65 inch variant and let's have a closer look at the same now. So guys, this is the television and as you can see, almost edge to edge that we have. And again, regarding the picture quality, if you notice, uh, the colors are produced very well on this one. This is a QLED, that's quantum dot. And the thing with this television is that it has 100% color volume. Uh, generally, most of the televisions actually uh, hover around 75 to about 85% in color volume. This is 100% color volume. That means all the colors that are visible to us in a human eye are produced by this television and the, uh, it produces over 1 billion colors and again noticed uh, how vibrant the picture quality is again if I put a, another television by side by side you'll notice the, how vibrant the colors are on this television uh, and also regarding brightness this can actually go very very bright it can go up to about 2000 nits that's very very bright hence even HDR content looks excellent on this uh, television the bright areas are really bright and even dark areas are produced very well it supports HDR HDR 10 and even HDR 10 plus and just notice the picture again the Sun is over here uh, how well it is producing uh, regarding the processor on this this has a quantum 4k processor so even if you have lower feeds that is like 720 or 1080p feed it automatically scales to 4k and i have to say the scaling is uh, done very well on uh, this one even normal uh, 720p or even uh, 1080p content looks excellent on this one and notice the colors and the sharpness uh, that is there now moving to the navigation again as you can see i've installed the popular apps uh, amazon prime netflix you YouTube, Apple TV, Z5, Hotstar, etc. And let's just switch to Netflix. And I just wanted to give you an idea about the sound on this one. This has something known as object tracking sound. And what it does is that let's say some action or something is happening from this side. It feels that the sound is coming from here. And if it moves here, it actually tracks that and you feel that the sound is actually moving. Uh, this has 60 watt RMS audio and it has four actually speakers here and uh, let me give you an idea let's just play this underground uh, six and uh, let me play the trailer let me just unmute it and increase the volume to give you an idea about the sound So again, I hope that gives you an idea about the sound and I don't know how they did this, but this OTS has actually a, a very good effect and uh, it sounds great. Uh, in fact, I would say if you go to the sound settings over here, by default, it will be in this uh, standard mode. But when I kept it in this amplify mode, the sound came actually really alive and the in fact it felt like it was having a built-in what do you say sound bar or something like that moving to another thing regarding the picture quality uh, one thing that I noticed on this television is that it has something known as adaptive uh, picture and even in your room let's say if the lighting changes it constantly actually analyzes that to get the best picture so you don't have to worry let's say uh, you put this television near a window or something and the lighting is changing uh, it constantly actually analyzes the lighting and adjust the picture quality so you don't have to worry about the picture quality as you can see the picture quality is really good on this one also moving to the blacks I felt that the blacks are also produced very well on this one and Samsung does claim that this uh, uh, 2020 range has improved blacks and as you can see a uh, it's actually produced very well and this is due to the uh, actually uh, local dimming it has uh, uh, full direct array local dimming hence even the black levels if you noticed are produced very well on this uh, television uh, and i did watch some movies on this one which had dark scenes and they were produced very well so even for dark scenes as you can see it produces it very well so guys, this is the remote controller that you get and as you can see, it's minimalistic in design but gets the job done. And this is also a Bluetooth uh, remote and also has voice capabilities. Uh, this one actually works with Bixby and Amazon Alexa. And I would say though the remote looks uh, minimal, it's fully functional and I like it. You control it easily via this and also has dedicated buttons for Netflix, Amazon Prime and Z5.
And guys, as I've told you, it comes with this one connect box and you have just one cable that goes towards the TV. It's attached over here and all the ports are over here. This is your power port. And uh, if you have that old style antenna, you can attach here. We also have for AV. If you have very old equipment, you get those accessories in the box actually. And we also have optical out. So if you have a home theater system, old one, you can connect it. Uh, we also have a physical LAN port. Uh, currently, we are connected with Wi-Fi. And uh, if you notice over here, we have have four HDMI ports and the third port is that EARC that is enhanced ARC port and the last one is actually the uh, gaming port that is HDMI 4 and this one actually supports HDMI 2.1 and uh, hence it is compatible with the new generation of consoles that are going to come that support 4k at 120 FPS. And guys, uh, you can actually pair this one with the Smart Things app and you can control a lot of things from the smartphone. For example, you can mirror what is there here, uh, let's say mirror to the television that's behind. I'll just press start now. And uh, as you can see, we see that there, but let's go to YouTube. Let's say this is the video and let's play this. And if I do like this, it will reflect on the TV. So you can cast whatever is there. Let me just pause this and let's, let's just get out of this i can hit this and i'm going to hit disconnect uh, we can also do a lot more things for example if i go back to this app and if i click here as you can see uh, uh view uh, tv on the phone also uh, you can use it so let's say something is playing there it'll be mirrored here as you can see here now it's being played over here so if i change anything it's if i go here let me just go to youtube on the tv and it's reflected here so let's say uh, you're watching something you have to go in another room uh, you can just move it like this and watch it on this so all these uh, functionality are available using the smart things app companion app that you can use with your smartphone so guys what do i feel about this uh, qled uh, television certainly one of the best 4k television out there and guys this is a review unit that was sent to me by samsung india and they have also sent me some notes and there are some offers if you're going to buy this uh, qled television now between 5th october and 20th november they say that uh, users can get uh, up to galaxy s20 ultra galaxy a31 or the galaxy a21s depending on the qled tv variant that you buy there will also be about 10% cashback offers and also EMI offers available on uh, this one. And regarding warranty, the regular warranty is generally 1 year, uh, but Samsung is giving 2 years extended warranty. So you'll get about 3 years warranty on this one. Apart from that, there are also offering 10 year no screen burn in warranty. Uh, so certainly a pretty good deal, I would say. And I would say if you are in the market uh, for looking for a premium high end 4K television certainly have a look at this one the picture quality is amazing as you can see even the sound was actually really good thanks to that OTS but uh, that's it for now guys uh, regarding the pricing and other information I'll leave the links in the description below guys so again make sure you check that out uh, that's it for now thanks for watching this is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video take care guys